Hey guys, Chad Taverney here with Vantage Point Outdoors. And in this video, I just wanted to talk with you briefly about why I've recently made the decision to shoot traditional archery. All right, guys. Um, about two months ago, mid-October, actually during this past hunting season, I made a pretty big decision which is going to change how I deer hunt in the coming years. Um, it's actually a two-part change. Um, the first thing is you probably know if you follow the Facebook page at all, um, you probably noticed that uh, we posted a lot of content and a lot of photos about hunting off the ground this past season. and. Uh, Pretty much from mid-October through the entire season, I pretty much did about 95% of my deer hunting from the ground in a still hunting, getting ahead of deer kind of fashion. I'm not talking about hunting out of a ground blind or making a makeshift ground blind and hunting in that. I'm talking about just hunting off the ground, finding fresh sign, setting up next to it against a tree or still hunting through the woods very quietly until you see a deer and then trying to figure out how you're going to get into range of that animal. So that's the a big change that I made this past season. I had in my in my opinion I had success with that even though I didn't kill a deer. I uh, I certainly could have. I passed up numerous shot opportunities this past season. I just never saw the buck I wanted to kill. But uh, I had a lot of, in my opinion, I had a lot of success hunting off the ground in that fashion. And, uh, and I'm going to continue to do that. And the decision, the next decision that I made, which is to shoot traditional bows from here on out, just kind of ties right into that first decision. Because in my opinion, after doing a lot of research and talking to a lot of guys who know more about it than I do, I personally think that shooting a traditional bow from the ground when you're ground hunting gives you the best hunting advantage in terms of getting your shot off at a deer before they have time to visually pick you off and bolt. So that's kind of a pretty uh, a pretty rad decision that I've made. Uh, some of my buddies think I'm crazy and have completely gone off my rocker, but you know what, I'm committed to it. I know that it's the thing I need to do and I know I have what it takes and the dedication to become good with these traditional bows and I simply am not going to stop shooting until that's the case. Um, I'm actually selling all of my compound bows and all of my compound uh, accessories and gear. I don't even want to have the temptation of falling back to the compound bows. I'm going 100% traditional from here on out and uh, it's a decision that I wanted to share with everybody here on the channel. And uh, so you'll be seeing some content here in the upcoming, you know, weeks, months, and years um, with my transition to, to traditional archery. Um, as I learn things, I'll be posting videos about, you know, what's working for me, what's not working for me, and what's helping me become a better shooter. So I'll be looking forward to seeing some of those videos here in the future. But today, I just kind of wanted to briefly, um, you know, present this to you. That I am making the switch to traditional archery so you'll be seeing a lot of content in the future on that and uh, you won't see me shooting compounds anymore but uh, as always I want to thank you for tuning into the show and I'll see you next time right here on the VPO Minute.